what's going on everyone, JT LEGO Productions here. Welcome back to another video and today I'm doing another LEGO set review. Right here we have set number 76055, Batman Killer Croc Sewer Smash. The set consists of 759 pieces, comes with Killer Croc, Captain Boomerang, Red Hood, Katana, and Batman. On the front of the box you can see you got this little giant crocodile I want to say mouth Captain Boomerang Killer Croc over here you got Red Hood and Katana down here you got Batman over here you got Lego Batman on the back it shows a bunch of features you can do you can uh, open this up here Batman can jump out you can have a uh, Katana going at him we're gonna have Red Hood going at Captain Boomerang. Down here, it shows a couple of things it can do. Looks like the um, Bat Tank, I'm gonna call it, can drop some bombs. Captain Boomerang, I'm thinking those those boomerangs. The, uh, I'm gonna start calling it the Croc Mobile. <laughs> can um, swing its tail. Killer Croc and Katana. Batman's tank again. Then over here, got another picture of the front again. The bottom, it just. Just all says all that. On the top, you got all the minifigures that are included in the set. If I can get them all in there. So, let's see how many bags this has first. I'm gonna... Let's take a look on what's inside. Inside, we have a bunch of bags. Right here you got the instructions. I'm gonna guess, yep, stickers are up there. You got Where's bag one? There it is. Bag one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Killer croc. And then his um croc thing. Wheels. So let's uh Let's get right on into the time lapse. Before this, uh, I start the time lapse here, if you guys are enjoying these uh, little set reviews, make sure to drop a comment below and uh, let me know and leave a like because the last video got a lot of support. I really enjoyed reading you guys' comments. Nine likes. Besides my brick films, I think that's like. Okay, that's probably the most likes I've gotten in a while. So thank you guys so much for that and uh, on to the time lapse. So that's probably going to be it for the time-lapse portion of this video, mostly because this piece here, the ones that you have to keep snapping together, this is like the most annoying thing ever because I always like snap my fingers on accident. And I basically have to do, um, this one you have to do 24, and I'm not, not excited about this. But, um, I just want to say one thing real quick. When you're doing this, please be careful because I've, snap myself on this like you can somewhat see it on here I don't have that good of lighting right now you can snap yourself really easily with these things and it hurts so if you ever build a set that has these be very careful and um let's get on the set review and here we have the finished product of the set as you can see here you have a uh, killer croc's little tank with his giant mouth 
Got crack up here. Got Captain Boomerang's little boomerang spot. Got Redhead's motorcycle with his uh, ton of or two guns, which I really like. I really like the uh, motorcycle sticker. Got Katana over here riding the uh, bat tank, and in here you got the Batman. So let's take a look at all the minifigs, and then we'll get to the sets. Here we have our first minifigure, which is the uh, Batman from uh, the latest lines. And this Batman has the same thing as everyone else, or every other one. A uh, cape that no one likes, got on the back, I'm just going to skip to the back. On the back, you got this little back design with the belt going all the way around, and his back. Up here, you have, you know, Frank you got the bat symbol, got all his abs, got that, uh, bat, uh, belt. Flip his head around, you got the other side. Katana, as you can see here, Katana has her little ninja sword, she has her, uh, Sash on there with a the red dot. Only one sided minifigure. Oh, 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 man. There we go. Uh, she has some armor on her chest there. Her legs are painted. On her arm, it kind I think this is, um. Who was it? It was, uh. Oh, God, I can't remember his name. Deadshot, I think it was. Pretty sure it was Deadshot, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, I believe that's who that arm is. On the back, you got some, uh, something that kind of looks like what they should do for Batman's belt. Got some more armor on the back. Still got the boots going all the way around. Back to the front. We got the red hood here, which I'm so glad that they finally gave us a red hood figure. So glad about that. As you can see here, he's got two guns, which I prefer over the, uh, flick guns. Or the uh, double guns, but this is just an amazing minifigure. I love it. Front here, you got his little symbol, got his jacket, got some armor under there, got his hood. Flip it around, you got a little back uh, painting there. The back, you got his uh, shirt with a little line going across. Back to the front. And, um, oh, I forgot to cover. You got this little belt down there with a little silver on it. Oh, we have Captain Boomerang. Without his boomerangs, because I took it. But if you give him a boomerang, then there. Now he's happy. Now the minifigure's all complete. He's happy. On the front here, you got Captain Boomerang's little uh, scarf going down his chest. Got the thing on his hat. And his legs here, got some uh, leg printing. Got a little belt there. Got more boomerangs on his vest. Nothing on the side. On the back, just got two little streaks. And his hat, this is not double sided in your face minifigure. But back to the front, nice boomerang. And the uh, last killer croc. Now I'm proud to move the camera. There we go. You can see in the front here, he's got some blue pants. He's got a little bit of uh, white over his green. The side, you don't have much, but on the back, you have this really nice detailing of his head. Uh, basically, how a crocodile would look. And I must say, this is a huge improvement over the um, uh, old Killer Croc, but I kind of still prefer the old Killer Croc. But, um, alright, then let's move on to the set. Here we have uh, Killer Croc's little, uh, little car. I, I'm going to call it the Croc Rock. No, it's not Pokemon. Okay, yes it is. But as you can see here on the front, got his little jaws here that uh, you can bite people with. So, if you want to be that guy. Got these giant wheels. Um, inside, you can see he got a wheel so that he can roll. Um, if you go to the side here, I got the giant wheels here. You see on this side, you have Captain Boomerang's little area where you shoot. I haven't actually tested that yet. That went pretty far. Oh... Oh, oh god, Boom, Boomerang is... No, wait, I'll get it later, because that's going to fall through. But up here, you got Captain Boomerang's little area. He just sits in there and doesn't actually clip in or anything. In the back, you got this nice little tail that, uh, when, uh, Batman's chasing you. Here, I have an idea. Give me one sec. You can have Batman in the Batmobile. Chasing after Killer Croc, and the t and he can get so close up 
tail whacks him off course, and then Batman dies. Rip. No, I'm just joking. Batman can't die. Got that? Up here, you got some uh, little computers. It shows the Batman tail and chomp. So, you press the tail. Tail waves back and forth. I wave my tail back and forth. I wave my tail back and forth. I guess I think of so many songs. You got chomp. It's like, oh, blah, blah, blah. Why did I in the audience box in that clip? I eat people. Okay. Now we're going to get rid of the base plate for this one because now we're moving on to the bat tank, which is what I'm calling it. So the bat tank here is actually a very, very, very nice built set. Definitely one of my favorite sets in the bat tank has these uh, parts right here that do flip, so you can like flip it, get some cool action shots. It does get caught there a little bit. We got this uh, front part here, which I'm gonna point it over there. And if you spin it, if it shoots, it actually does go pretty far. Um, I probably will do like a separate video on all the um, Lego shooters. Maybe if we get 10 likes, I'll do that. 10 likes and that video's coming. On the front here, you can see you got the little part where he rides on. Got some nice, kind of looks like some armor stuff right there. Got a uh, little, actually I don't know what that is. But up here you got the cockpit where Batman sits, goes up and down. Got this piece of glass right there. On this side you can see you got some uh, lights right here. So when Batman's driving in the dark at night, he doesn't crash into something. You got this little plating over here. It's like really open right here, so if you're... Uh, a brick filmer like me, and you just want your red hood to just go sliding under this and not get hit, you can do that. They finally gave you a set where you can have something small go under it and not have to actually mask it green screen or anything. But so pretty cool. Got this other uh, part back here, another part there. I feel like this is more something for Batman instead of riding in Gotham, just to, like go up the mountains and take a uh, little family trip. Got this little plating here that you can flip up and down. Kind of looks like bat ears almost. On the back here, you got this. Uh, I don't remember what you want to call this, but kind of like a rocket almost or something. But right here, this part, if you flip this. It goes, but then when you try to turn it back, it doesn't for me. I have to hold out this red part. So do that. Hold out the red part and let it flip back. So I do it from a side angle. It goes up, flip over. Hold the red back. There we go. Do it from the front now. It almost just kind of looks like it's like plating for the front like if he's getting gunshot at him then he can like flip this forward if he doesn't want to if he doesn't want that much uh uh damage done you can just flip forward and let it hit the front protect him a little bit let me try and put this back all right and then back here you got some little bombs that also drop off so that you can uh, knock out some villains on the side, I got the same thing as the other side. Got your little headlights up here. Got plating on the side. Got you can go underneath. And the front. And that's it. That's gonna be it for this video. If you guys did enjoy this uh, another set review, make sure to drop a comment down below saying you did hit that like button. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I will see you guys next time with either another set review or a uh, brick film. Hopefully, um, brick film coming soon. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.